I'm attorney George McCraney. I have offices in Douglas and Valdosta, Georgia. Today, I wanted to talk with you about going to trial in Georgia. And this is part five of uh, my series about going to trial in Georgia. And I practiced criminal law in Georgia for over 20 years. And if you want to see the other yeah, uh, videos and catch up, go back and watch them. You can catch up on the different things that, that uh, we talked about, about going to trial, how serious it is, things you need to look at, things you need to understand. Now, we've already talked about in the previous past four videos how serious your decision that you want to go to trial in Georgia is. Now, the last thing I want to talk about is I want to talk about your case. OK, I want to talk about what you need to understand about your case. All right. Now, your attorney should not be a yes man or woman. Your attorney should be 100 percent up front with you about your case. OK, the attorney should tell you the good, the bad and the ugly about your case. The attorney shouldn't blow smoke. You should know everything about it. OK, if you have a good case. The attorney should tell you. If you have a mediocre case, the attorney should tell you. If you have a bad case, okay, the attorney should tell you. And be up front, 100% straight up about your chances at trial. All right, let me give you an example. All right, several years ago, I had a case where there was a CI involved in it. It was a marijuana case, a marijuana sale case. A CI is a confidential informant that works for law enforcement. OK, well, the CI saw marijuana, so, uh, the alleged marijuana at my client's house. All right. The CI bought marijuana from my client on video. OK, had audio and video. My client admitted to selling all right, marijuana to the CI previously. OK, and they had all this evidence. They got a search warrant. They searched my client's home. They found money. They found pounds of marijuana uh, on the video after they read uh, the Miranda rights tool, my client. My client admitted on video to selling the marijuana and that the marijuana at the house belonged to them. Okay. Now, on the face of it, this is not a case that should go to trial. Okay. The lawyer should tell the client all the bad things about the case. OK, and the lawyer should tell you what most likely can happen at a trial. Now, knowing all this good, bad and ugly about the case, good part of it was the person never been convicted before. All right. Bad part was everything I told you. The videos were bad. I mean, the evidence was bad. The everything statements made after valid Miranda warnings were bad. Everything was bad. So the question is, is what can a good attorney a dedicated defense attorney do to help that client, okay? Well, in this situation, got the case dismissed. Here's how it works. We knew we didn't want to go to trial. This was not something that I thought and the client thought that we could win at a trial, all right? So the trick is don't go to trial. So through research, I found out who the government CI was. All right, and I made the move, the legal move, to force the government to what's called burn their CI, okay? That means expose their CI in court so the CI is identified as being a confidential informant for the government. Luckily, this CI was very important to the government. They were using the CI to go after bigger fish than my client. My client was not a big fish, okay? So the result of this is pushing forward before we ever got to trial to push to hit the government in their weak spot. And luckily for us, that CI was very important to them. So they didn't want to burn their CI. The result was case dismissed. Okay. So the point of it is, is that even if you have what you think is a bad case, even if the evidence looks bad against you, you still need to go and talk to an experienced criminal defense attorney because there may be something else that that attorney can do for you like we were able to do for this client, okay? So choose your defense attorney wisely, all right? Don't go on the cost of the attorney because a lot of times you get what you pay for, okay? Hey, 
I want to thank you for watching this series of videos and this video especially. Hey, if you like the video, please like it below. And if you got a question or a comment, if you got a comment, please comment below. I like to see your comments. I love to read those, see what everybody thinks about them. And uh, if you'd like to contact me, the easy way is to message me. You can message me on here and we'll be glad to get an answer back to you. Make it real simple to get that answer for you. Or you can call me. You can reach me at 833-927-6227. And if you've got questions, we'll help you get the answers that you need. Okay, again, I'm George McCraney, an attorney with offices in Douglas and Valdosta, Georgia. We do criminal offense, serious personal injury, and family-based immigration. If you've got a question, contact us, and thank you for watching the video.